Hi, I'm Chad with Ambic, and I'm really happy to be here today at Embedded World with one of our preferred technology partners. Chris, can you tell us a little bit about yourself and your sure, company? Sure, sure. Uh, Chris Giuliano, I'm with uh, our uh, uh, business unit at Xperia, ICS, Integrated Circuits. Uh, we represent uh, the team that does energy harvesting PMIX. So I'm a product marketing manager, and uh, we have Rodrigo with us today. Yeah, and I work as a product manager for new product development uh, in the energy harvesting portfolio. Okay. We're producing and delivering 100 billion parts a year. Wow. So our customers, large consumer companies, industrial companies, they require very high standards, oh my. Uh, assurance of delivery of supply. That's kind of fundamental to our DNA in Xperia is okay. the ability to manufacture uh, high volume, uh, on time, at low cost. Over the last year with Ambic, we've been working uh, also with MicroE mm -hmm. uh, on the uh, the newest uh, harvest kit uh, with clipboard system. Uh, so now, today, well, in a few months ago, you released uh, on DigiKey the first version, which has the uh, module. So it has our very first energy harvesting chip, the NEH yeah. 2000. Okay. Um, and maybe today we can talk a little bit more about the iterations. Awesome. Um, newer chips that are coming. Um, uh, Rodrigo, you can talk a little bit more about the next chip, which will be available for the harvest kit, is the NEH 7100. Yeah, so the 7100 is already available in the market and okay. in, come, in the coming weeks, it will be available also in the click module. So the key difference between the 7200 and the 2000 is because the 7200 is, uh, is more complete in terms of battery protection features. It will have USB charger, ah. LDO, so it will be uh, feature rich. When That's compared. great. Yeah. So we had to add our own charging circuit on the current harvest kit. So your new chip is incorporating that battery charging function in the harvesting PMIC itself. Yes, absolutely. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and the 7100 can work in parallel with the 2000 in your harvest kit. You have already one uh, one slot yeah. uh, available, so you can just plug the 7100. And yeah, that's great. Function. So people can buy the harvest kit as it is, and there is that one free slot. There's a total of four slots. Two of them are set up for harvesting with that special connector that Mikuri put down on for yep. us so that the click module can power the main board. Absolutely. So so we've got one free of those. It works as a general purpose click interface, but for people that want to use harvesting applications, um, um, the click module will have the extra two pins and it'll power our board. So um, so you're saying that people can buy this new click module yes. with the new 7100 yes. chip on it? And, and connect, plug it, in. it will be transparent for the user. Cool, so they can either replace the original click module that comes with the kit or, or put it in parallel and run yeah. both. Exactly. That yeah. sounds awesome. That's awesome.